Thank you. Welcome everyone to the March 13th Norwich Airport Commission meeting. Uh, first of all, uh, please turn off any of your phones because we don't have any unnecessary interruptions. NCM Norwich Community <coughs> Media is filming this. Is there any other entity filming this meeting? Chris Donovan, Boston Executive Helicopter. Thank you. Chris Donovan, Boston Executive, is filming this meeting. First on the agenda, we have uh, AIP project update with Jeff Adler <coughs> from Duke Boys and King. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. For the record, Jeff Adler with the Boys and King. Um, so, just a quick update. I know even your packets regarding the Taxiway Alpha um, relocation project. We had applied um, to basically reduce the grant to eliminate taxiway delta, which is what I updated you on last month. Um, we submitted that um, to FAA, um, which was what they wanted. Um, now just, there's a possibility now that FAA would like to finish the project with some additional funding. So right now we're kind of just waiting to, to hear if that's gonna come to play. They said they would try to get back to us this week with some more information, so. I just wanted to update the commission. I don't know that that's going to happen, but there's a there's a possibility, I guess, at this point. So we will uh, we will wait to say wait to see how it all plays out. So um, I don't know if anybody, anybody has any questions on that or not, but that's that's basically what I know at this point. The funding's there as far as FAA and correct Mass DOT. Correct. The airport. We don't have enough to do that taxiway D now. Is that correct, Russ? Correct. Right. So there's some, but there's some discussion about how that could maybe be worked out. Great. So that's that's why it came back. Not they clearly understood previously that there wasn't enough local share. Terrific. So now they're trying to see if there's a way they can handle that, and if we could do it, if that was taken care of. So, so that's why the discussions have been reopened. And that's a four hundred and forty thousand dollar project. Correct. Great. Correct. Okay. So. I'll certainly, I mean, Russ is, we're both in tune, we're supposed to hear back, so there's a potential for a meeting with them to kind of sort out the details of it. So as soon as we know, we'll, Russ will certainly advise mm -hmm. the commission. Mm -hmm. Okay. Any questions? Yeah. Okay, next. Um, next is the um, technical master plan update. So I think we've gotten all final comments, got some comments from Chairman Ryan. Um, and so, like I said, the, the next step is to schedule the, um, a public meeting. So I think if the commission, I mean, you don't have to do it today, but if you mm -hmm. could relate to Russ and talk about potential dates or whatever and locations, then we can certainly um, get that set up. And then there'd be the final draft submission to FAA after that public meeting. That's basically where we're at. So that'd have to be in a larger community room? Correct. Correct. We had one, I think, for the... Variance one, Russ. We had it downtown. Recreation department. Yeah, which was that was a nice room. Okay, okay. so we got so you're working on that, you know, recreation or yep. the uh, police and fire station, whatever's yep. available. Okay. Yep. And then you'll work on dates and work on dates, and as soon as we get that set up, we'll have that, and then that will, you know, finalize the getting any com public comment. Mm -hmm. uh, it will certainly give a presentation on what we've done so far and take public comment, and then roll that into the final. Draft submission to FAA, and then they might be able to go back to the Should do it. Yeah, I know I have a telephone conference call with Guy from your office tomorrow. Yeah. To okay. Yeah, we'll over comments. Over your comments. Yeah. 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 No, I think they were fine. And any questions on that? No. All right. That's it for me. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, Jeff. Jeff. Thanks, Jeff. <coughs> uh, airport commission. Oh, first of all, is everyone signed in? Is it sign in sheet? Russ, you want to check that, please? And anyone you notice that hasn't signed in, Russ, please uh, make note of it. On the sheet, please. Yep. Um, the airport commission meeting, business meeting, uh, minutes of November 14th. Motion to accept the minutes. Second. Made and seconded. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? None. We have the January 16th regular business meeting minutes.
motion to approve. Motion made and seconded. All those in favor? Aye. Opposed? None. And February 25th, business meeting. That's the special one, right, Russ? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Motion to approve. Motion made. Second. And second. Are all those in favor? Aye. 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 Approved. Thank you. Russ, you want to go over your uh, airport manager's report, please? Mr. Chairman, other than the written record, the only thing I'd like to uh, add is the spreadsheet that uh, is a copy of the, the spreadsheet in front of each of the commissioners, and this is a breakdown of the contract of snow removal cost to date um, and as you can see uh, we're about fifteen hundred dollars over budget right now we were we budgeted for forty six thousand dollars and uh, as of the Sunday storm uh, we're, we're now over budget uh, this has been brought to the attention of the town manager's office at the town manager's request and um, obviously the Commission now has it um, I guess there are several options um, that the town manager has passed along. One is a, a request for a reserve fund transfer, or if there's a uh, snow ice emergency declaration, we could uh, ask to be added to that. But uh, since looking at last year's uh, snow removal costs from the second week of March to the end of the snow season, we incurred another $17,000. It's not uh, outlandish to think that we may have another several sto several storms to, to get through. Well, you have no option. You either do either the reserve fund transfer, right, or you can wait till um, the April town meeting for a special right. article to uh, ask funds to be transferred from some of the areas, right. I know they're getting short on cash for a reserve fund. PJ, wait for the payment on this? I, I believe so. I haven't <clears throat> even received the, the invoice uh, in, in the regular mail yet. I just am aware of it through the uh, email. So is there a motion to have Russ explore the best way to uh, uh, obtain funds for the uh, invoicing for snow and ice for $1,720. Uh, so moved. So, can I have a question? Yeah. Uh, so the options are town meeting, or res transfer re reserve funds, or the last one was state of emergency? Yeah, I don't know if they did. Right. Did they give anything on we that? We haven't done the state yeah, of they, emergency. We're wait, yeah. yeah, we're waiting on Sometimes that course. comes later. All right. Yeah. OK. So one of several Just options. a motion just that, uh, to let him take a look at okay, it. OK, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> so you're seconding it? Yes, I am. Motion made and seconded. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? None. Okay, Russ. Anything else? Other than that, Mr. Chairman, uh, I'd like to think everything on the written report is self-explanatory. If there are any questions, comments about the report? I may have a question. Yes, Mr. Sheehan. Off of the report, thanks. It's not on the report, Russ. Uh, thank you, Mr. Chairman. Um, so all of the tenants of the West Apron have been notified and they'll be off April 1st, right? Yes. Are they able to relocate at other locations at the airport? Several have uh, either left the airport or they're in the process of trying to uh, get secure another tie down. Yeah, so, so, so we did lose, did lose some. We're in the time. process of losing. Yeah. Do you know how many of us? Roughly. I'd say I sent out 22 mm -hmm. in total, and that includes the DC3 uh, apron as well. well yeah. 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 I take it the ones that left weren't happy? Well, they preferred to stay yeah. on the West Apron. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where do they go, Russ? Any stay local? Uh, on the airport? One or? went to Rhode Island. Several have sold their aircraft and. Uh, I would say three or four at least are looking for all all diff all all options. They're they've contacted. I understand <coughs> the level. Oh, okay. No way to see the uh, 
what happens on the West Apron. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, we got if we get a comedy in. Uh, thank you, thank you, Mr. Chairman. Motion to approve the uh, program manager's report. Motion made and seconded. Second. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? No. All right, what do we have here? We've got um, the Harding letter of determination. We talked about that with Jeff. The contract, Russ, that's uh, for the, that's just for information as far as the uh, access control system? That's correct. That payment voucher has been submitted to uh, MassDOT. And it's 100% funding? That's correct. Correct. That's great. Okay. Um, we have uh, two letters in your package from different helicopter individuals, Frank Egan and Mike Correa, uh, expressing their concern about Boston Executive Fuel Truck. Mr. Chairman? Yes, Mr. Th Sheehan. These are just letters, but I'd, I'd like to ask Russ uh, and make it in the form of a motion that he look into this further and speak with these individuals and get a little bit more information and update us uh, at the next meeting. That's a motion? That's a motion, yeah. I, I, I guess I'll comment. Yes. Um, John? Sorry. I don't think I have them. Let's see. Oh, right there. There, there we go. Uh, that was my question was, is, have you spoken to these people? I have not spoken okay. to them. Then I second that motion. Motion made and seconded. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? None. This took place February 4th? Uh, yes. Yeah. What was that, John? No, I just wanted to know the date of it was. Yes. All oh, the letters? Yeah, no, that was the date of it, or that was so the, when you, yeah, the letter? When did you receive them? Uh, I would say within the, a week after uh, February 4th. Okay. That's I was just wasn't sure if that was the date on the letter yeah. or if that I was I believe the they were in your February packets for the meeting that was canceled, mm -hmm. so they were prior to the meeting. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You didn't uh, cover this here. Well, thank you, Mr. Sheen. Yep, there's a uh, judgment of dismissal here from Judge Stearns. And, uh, I'd like to read it into the record. Very well. We're still alive. Very well. <coughs> Judgment of dismissal, this action having been reported, settled by the parties. The court entered a settlement order of dismissal on December 7, 2018. On January 23, 2019, the court granted in part and denied in part plaintiff's motion to enforce settlement agreement or vacate settlement order of dismissal and reopen case. By order entered on January 23, 2019, the court enforced the December 19, 2018 general release and settlement reached between the parties and denied the plaintiff's request to vacate the settlement order of dismissal and reopen the case. This case is now closed. It is hereby ordered and adjudged in accordance with the court order dated January 23, 2019 and Federal Civil Procedure 58A final judgment of dismissal is hereby entered without cost of attorney fees to any party. And I'd ask that be placed on file. Thank you, Mr. Sheehan. All right, so um, I'd be looking for a motion to go in executive session. Purpose three for executive session, to discuss strategy with respect to litigation if an open meeting may have detrimental effect on the litigating position of the Norwood Airport Commission, one, Boston Executive Helicopters versus Town of Norwood, two, Boston Executive Helicopters versus Norwood Airport Commission, and also to uh, vote on executive session meeting minutes of November 14th and January 16th. And we will return only for the purpose of adjourning. Correct. Thank you, right. Mr. Sheehan. So, you got it, Monty. So moved. Motion made and seconded. Mr. Cochran. Yes. Mr. Sheehan. Yes. Mr. 
Mr. Osterschatz, yes. Mr. Ryan votes yes. Thank you, everyone.